Thank you so much for seeing me under these circumstances. I just, I can't take it anymore. This is your fourth meeting this week and it's only Wednesday. But I understand. Our Straight Girls Anonymous meetings weren't deemed essential. This was an emergency. She has a second lesbian best friend. And how does that make you feel? It makes me feel like watching Jenny's wedding on repeat and texting all of my exes. And now I've been kicked out of her bubble because as she says, I only need one lesbian friend. What exactly happened? So this lesbian is her work wife, what I would do to be called her wife in any capacity. She was like, oh, I know another lesbian. I'll introduce you. Maybe you guys will hit it off. Classic straight girl setup. Right? What's this new LBF like? Would you guys hit it off? Her favorite L word character is Jenny. Yikes. This lesbian is completely replacing me. Like this morning, my SBF got her haircut. Side note, she sent me a whole bunch of pictures of Kristen Stewart and was like, hey, do you think these haircuts would look cute on me? Serpa. Does it matter? No, they're all gay. And then she posted a picture of her new haircut on Instagram with the caption, new hair, who dis? Thanks for paying for my haircut at Jenny Shecks for life. I used to be the one that paid for her haircuts and her manicures and her pedicures and her facials and like anything she needed. Maybe it's a good thing she's no longer financially dependent on you. Who is this woman? Why did none of my patients recover? And I know this lesbian is in love with her. How do you know for sure? Um, my best friend is straight and this woman is a lesbian. So I want to try something new today. Really dive into your subconscious. I will try anything. I'm like my straight best friend. I'm gonna show you a series of photos and I just want you to tell me the first few thoughts that come to mind. <sighs> okay, I'm ready. This one. Well, like first thing that comes to mind, I don't know, is like me going in for a hug with my straight best friend after I changed her oil and she was like, don't touch me because you're dirty. This one? The dream I had last night about my SPF. How about this one? Me and my SPF in five years after she realizes that she's been in love with me all this time. This one? My SPF's vagina. Breakfast, the answer was breakfast. I think you could be making some progress. Okay, I've only thought about her four times this past minute, so it's like pretty good. Um, also, where did you get those photos? Can I have some of them? Oh, I grabbed them on Storyblocks. It's a affordable stock subscription service. It's got 4K video footage, Premiere, After Effects templates, photos, audio, so much. Do they have pictures of straight girls that I can download? Yeah, and with their unlimited all access plan, you can download as many as you want. Unlimited? over 1 million royalty-free straight girl assets. And if you're into diversity. Who is not into diversity? They're committed to having 20% of all of their stock footage include BIPOC by 2022 with restock. Will this help me get over my SPF? Can't hurt. I'll write you a subscription. She just posted a pic of her and her new LBF and somebody captioned, cute couple. I'll squeeze you in for another session tonight. I'm gonna vomit. And if anyone else is interested in getting over their SPF with unlimited stock assets, check out Storyblocks, a link is in the description.